Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 13 of the Aqua Top and White Sands. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I wonder what the opening's gonna look like. Cause I mean, they have to change it. It makes you wonder how in the world they got that big ass fish in there. You'll do fine. Yeah. <laughs> Aww. Of course it would be a picture. But still, it makes you wonder, like, if Fuka is going to make um, an appearance in this. Because since we are in the second half and... I'm guessing that's going to be the only time she's going to be. Oh, there she is. <laughs> but, <laughs> of course, she's not going to be a regular because of the fact that she had to move back home. Ah. So basically, they're going to be neighbors. Mm -hmm. There you go. The opening just spoiled it. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I know. PR. Like, mm. But it might be good. Be positive about it. I know. It, it, it really seems like a boring job, but... <laughs> That was the Kokoro tears right there. <laughs> Sit.
Yeah, he's so pretty. Well, I feel like I'm not going to like him. You want her to read the effing manual? Who reads the manual? But how are you so sure about that? She would be a bitch. <laughs> Come on. Ah. It makes you wish you could customize the heck out of your aquarium in Animal Crossing. PA works like went out on this. Oh my god. That was freaking beautiful. Oh my god.
Neither. I, I know, right? Like, how is she supposed to? <laughs> I hate the fact that she is so bitchy. Oh, that's a fuck you. Come on now. That's good. True. Yeah, so this would be a really big opportunity for you, babe. Mm -hmm. So just try it out. I know. <laughs> right. You would think that would, like, once they would show her. But I'm guessing they're waiting for the right opportunity, you know? was all the way in the bottom.
She's got enough time. Don't worry about it. Please, like... <sighs> let me like this girl by the end of this series because, whoa, I don't like this chick. Like, let me see a nice side to her. Not that, you know, let me be a mean, nasty to your face. Nice, nasty bitch. Like, oh. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah. True. Oh, screw you. You know, I, I really don't think so because I really don't see any hope. They're always going to fight. Oh, AJ. Baby. 
It is. <laughs> yeah, it is, because you're not going to get along with everybody. And there are going to be some days where you really want to cry. I, I know you're feeling... Oh, we get a new ending too! Oh my god! <laughs> oh god, I feel so bad for Pukuru. Like, Jesus, like, yes. I mean, you're now at a time where you're not a little kid anymore and you're an adult and you're gonna deal with a lot of adult situations. And not everybody is going to like you for how sweet, kind, positive, upbeat you 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 are basically at the end of the day and even with Kukuru doing some things on her own because so many people weren't checking their emails and talking to other people and this is that and the third of course she had the right initiative to take it and be like fuck it I'm gonna do it by myself because of course that's initially what most of us do if someone's not gonna handle something and then if they said oh well I checked it or I was too busy and I didn't have time to check it of course you're gonna get pissed you're gonna be like fuck it I want to do it myself I, I hate the fact that, you know, she got in trouble for it, but I, I think she's going to learn. I, I mean, as much as just like everybody else in Kuri Kukuru herself wondering, like, why in the world did I get a PR job? What is this going to do? I, I feel like the director, he has good intentions, but we're, we're still seeing it. I think by the time we do finish the show, that is when we will truly see what she is capable of because she is capable of, to do anything and more I just think it's going to take her a little while to you know warm up with her supervisor and this is on the third now the girl who is officially back in this damn show okay I still like to call her a bitch because she is a bitch I, the fact is that yes she is now the senior to Kukuru I'm fine with that but it, it's like you can you not be bitchy for like five minutes could you not be nice nasty to her for five effing minutes like oh my god because every single time she's around her she's the one who always starts a freaking argument you are the one who has the initiative if you are this so-called quote-unquote senior you still got to be nice to her, despite how you two feel about each other, and y'all don't give two craps about each other. Something's going to tell me, like, it, it's going to take a little while, so maybe give about, like, three, not even three, mm -mm. give it about a good five episodes. Something is going to make these two initially kind of, like, make up and start over again from the beginning and try to have a better relationship of what the hell they have now. Or by the end of the series, they may never really have a friendship, but... I'm happy that Fuka is back because it, it would have felt really, really weird if we would have continued this whole second half of the show and Fuka would have had no apparent, like, appearance or anything. But the fact is that, you know, she's still there. She's going to be with her and every step of the way is sweet. I mean, you know, every once again, everybody looks at these two as like a, sh a couple. They are, in a way, a couple. They have a lot of shippable moments together, but then there are times um because I do shift them as well there are times especially with the fact is you know she's like yeah are you crying da, 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 da. and then you know long time no see and they embrace where it's it seems more like a sisterly love 
between these two, even though they're not sisters, they're just really, they're just friends. But even though at the same time, I'm like, yeah, even though y'all are really, really close and you feel like sisterly love and this is that and there, y'all still belong together. I mean, because the funny thing was, I remember at the beginning of this show, like, people were like, any moment between these two, they, because... <laughs> like well this isn't a yuri and i was like no it's not a yuri but it has yuri moments and i mean it's one of many shows that like i said is not yuri but has moments of yuri in it and it's adorable and i still love it but let's just you know hope and pray kukuru can get this and be a damn good pr because i know she can she has the ability to do this it's just gonna take her time to find herself She's going to have to deal with so many more harder situations that she had to in Gama Gama. And now that Fuka is here with her, I think she's going to be able to truly talk it out with her. And, you know, yeah, this is that and the third. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 13 of the Aqua Top and White Sand. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Thursday for episode 14. Bye, guys.